Chapter 6 Sprint Training and Recovery In this section, we're going to expand on some recovery techniques that you can do after a sprint session to improve your body's ability to recover from the intense workout that you had. Proper recovery is vital to avoid excessive soreness and will allow your body to build up the right muscles to improve your ability to sprint. There are three main aspects of recovery that you're going to cover, so keep reading. Water Staying hydrated is necessary for all of your body's functions, and is especially important when your body is losing extra water through sweat and working harder than normal. Avoiding drinking a lot of water before you work out because you don't want it sloshing around your stomach as you run, but be sure to drink at least 3 glasses, 24 ounces of water, within an hour after your workout, then continue drinking for the rest of the day. Nutrition If you're not giving your body what it needs to build your muscles up and recover from an intense workout, you're going to find yourself struggling day after day. If you, don't wa if you want your body to be as healthy as possible, you can't do it with exercise alone, so if you haven't already made changes to your diet to improve your health, it's time to start. Shortly after your workout, you want to give your body a big dose of protein and a few simple sugars. Protein is what your muscles will use to repair the damage you did during the workout and make your muscles stronger. Simple sugars are important because you have likely burned through what you had in your body before. Having a protein shake with a piece of fruit is a perfect post-workout snack. About an hour after your workout, you'll want to eat a good meal that includes more lean protein, some healthy fats, and lots of vegetables. Getting plenty of vegetables will not only give you some more good carbohydrates that your body can use, but it will also provide you with a ton of antioxidants which help remove the waste your muscles burn during the workout. Sleep You want to make sure that you're getting plenty of sleep when you're pushing your body hard for sprinting training. If possible, you should take a nap about 2 hours after your workout. The timing is important because it's about 2 hours after your exercise that your body really starts repairing the muscle damage, so allowing yourself to completely rest during that time will help your body focus fully on recovery. It's also important that you're getting enough sleep at night. Most adults should be getting between 7 and 8 hours of sleep every night. Sprint training and exercising in general should help you feel more tired at the end of the day, but if you're still not getting all the sleep you need, there are a number of techniques that you can try that will help you get a full night of rest every night. The bottom line with recovery is that the better you recover, the better you can sprint on the next training day.